Momchis and Friends! Welcome back to our channel! So in today's episode, I will be showing you how we baby-proof or toddler-proof our home plus additional tips on how to save space in a small apartment like this. So, please keep on watching! So to start off, here's our small bedroom. So this is what you call the window guard or you can also use it for as a door lock. So this is very difficult to open. So you, re you really need to push this uh, really hard. So any kid won't be able to open your window. Here by the window is the premium edge protection. We use this for hard edges like this marble and for tables and for our TV rack. We used to have a side table in this bedroom, but now to save space for the baby bed, we build this shelf on top of the board head. It saves a lot of space and it keeps everything away from our baby. We literally use this safety lock in all electrical sockets that might be at our baby's reach. We try to utilize every space that we have for this 10 square meter bedroom. Placing all the unnecessary items for the moment on top of the cabinets or underneath your bed is a great way to save space. Here in our bathroom, you can find the baby changing table. This table on top of the washing machine saved a lot of money and space compared to buying separate diaper changing tables. We got this hanging organizer for children as a gift. It is very convenient storage for baby diapers and crimps. This bamboo laundry basket is also a perfect fit in our small bathroom. It can easily hold a week-long dirty laundry. This safety lock is really a big help for the cabinets. But unfortunately, it doesn't really stick to the toilet bowl. And finally, this non-slip shower mat is really a must for your kids' safety. Our small kitchen secured by those locks and the key to make this time space work is to have lots of cabinets and make sure you remove everything heavy at the bottom part of the racks a shoe rack with a seat on top is perfect for saving space too and everything that is ugly just hide it using a curtain Welcome to our living room. So here's more protection using the premium edge for our center table and for our TV rack. As you can see, this cabinet is secured with wood and glass doors. So that's how it looked before with the open bookshelf. And now, which is more organized. In this area of our living room, you can find a small office, the baby playstation, and it serves as our guest room too. This puzzle mat is really good for baby's brain development and a safe place for playing too. This hanging organizer is great for keeping remote controls and chargers away from our little one. This Kallax cabinet from IKEA is a good buy for saving a lot of space. 
and keeping Miri's toys in place. We make sure she only has maximum of two boxes of toys. The bookshelf on the other side of the living room is a perfect fit here on this area. We place a side table in front of it to keep the books away from our baby. And this sofa bed accommodates two guests here in our lovely home. And that's it for today. I hope you learned something new from today's video. Thank you so much. Bisum nestus ma. Cheers.